Big news in activist land this morning. Investor Bill Ackman saying he's no longer going to take part in vocal activist short selling campaigns. In his annual letter, Ackman writing, quote, despite our limited participation in this investment strategy, of course, he had a big version of that strategy back in the day with Herbalife. Uh, it has generated enormous media attention for Pershing Square. Yes, it has. Then he said, quote, fortunately for all of us and as importantly for our reputation as a supportive, constructive owner, we've permanently retired from this line of work. Among the short selling campaigns, the hedge fund waged that high profile battle against Herbalife, as we mentioned, ended with some massive losses in 2018. Ackman also shorted mortgage loan companies Fannie Mae and Freddie Mac back in 2007 before the financial crisis, when then which then turned out to be a very successful bet. Ackman now says he's ready to focus on what he's calling long-term, quieter bets. Pershing's current stakes include Netflix, Universal Music Group, Chipotle, Domino's, restaurants, brands. I would think you would like all these brands, Joe. Uh, home improvement I like, retailer. I like their products. Um, yeah, Lowe's. I like Taco Bell more. Right? Lowe's is a, is a friendly... I don't know. I, I think it's... <laughs> I immediately thought, I guess it's semantics. If you wage an activist campaign against the S&P and are short that, does that count? Yeah. I mean, you, can, but you can't. So he's not going to do that anymore? I, that's not what they're talking about. They're talking about individual names. You individual know what I'm names. referring back yep. to. They, they, he was kind of an activist on the short side of the S&P, but he was actually covering or buying or I don't know.